Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. My name is Jawa Jawa Tuzi Bifli, 21-80501. How does Starbucks have the best information system implementation? Timeline. In 1971, Starbucks founded by Jerry Baldwin, Zach Siegel, and Gordon Bowker. Starbucks inspired to sell high-quality coffee beans and equipment by coffee roasting entrepreneur Alfred Pitt. The first Starbucks store was located in Seattle at 2015 Avenue from 1971 to 1976. They later moved the cafe to 1912 Pike Place. In 1987, Starbucks opened its first location outside of Seattle in Waterfront Station in Vancouver, British Columbia and Chicago, Illinois. In 1999, Starbucks experimented with eateries in the San Francisco Bay Area through a restaurant chain called Sicardia. After people learned that this restaurant were owned by Starbucks, Starbucks converted the restaurants to Starbucks cafes. In 2008, Starbucks started a community website, My Starbucks Idea, to collect suggestions and feedback from customers. In 2018, Starbucks announced the blockchain technology which is an idea to connect more coffee drinkers with coffee farmers so it is eventually taking advantage of new financial opportunities. Recently in 2021, Starbucks have 32,943 coffee houses in 76 countries even in COVID-19 pandemic. There are four types of information system used by Starbucks. First, transaction processing system. Second, supply chain management system. Third, decision support system. And lastly, customer relationship management system. In this video, we will talk about Decision Support System. So what is Decision Support System? Decision Support System is used to analyze business data. Decision Support System or DSS is the auxiliary decision makers through the data, models and knowledge, human-computer interaction way for semi-structured or unstructured decision-making computer application system. DSS is a computer program application that analyzes business data and presents it so that user can more easily take their business decision. Before we go through to our discussion, which is decision support system, let's talk about Starbucks Global Supply Chain. Starbucks Global Supply Chain is plan, source, make, and deliver. Plan is everything from raw materials to manufacturing to retail market. Source is have coffee department source. Make is obviously roast and package the coffee beans. And lastly deliver. Starbucks have 17,000 delivery per week. And if you want to know, delivery tip is all make it happen. Starbucks use online analytical processing or we call it as OLAP as their decision support system. So what OLAP can do? OLAP can do the large-scale data analysis and statistical analysis that as a references to manage for their decision making. Starbucks use a singular DSS system at the parent company in USA, which is Oracle. So, 
Oracle generates monthly reports on which important decisions are based. So, only the parent company, which is Oracle, has the authority to make decisions about products. You must be wondering why Starbucks choose Oracle Online Analytical Processing as their decision support system. So, there are five reasons why Starbucks choose this. First, OLAP is easily to define a multi-dimensional model with advanced analytical calculation. Second, productively deliver rich analytics to any reporting and analysis tool using simple SQL. Next, transparently improve summary queries against tables using cube-based materialized views. Furthermore, you can combine OLAP data with any other data in Oracle database, including spatial, data mining, SML, documents, and more. And lastly, leverage existing Oracle database expertise and software investment. With all of these great reasons, that's why Starbucks choose Oracle OLAP. In a nutshell, Starbucks is just like any other businesses, starting with all system, technology and outdated promotional strengths as well as price increases. Starbucks use Oracle Online Analytical Processing, or we call it as OLAP, as their primary information system. This makes Starbucks have the best information system experts for choosing the information systems they are capable of making Starbucks today. Starbucks has also managed to spread their wings to 76 countries.